For us, the battle board helps us be successful, and success is when opportunity meets preparedness. My experience with the Battle Board has been amazing, to say the least. What the Battle Board does best for us is it brings a whole new level of professionalism to our job. So for the longest time, we used our own DIY first two guidebooks, and we've now evolved into the Battle Board platform. It keeps our communications clear and concise, and we can pass that information along to keep the incident running. Everything from the incident command system moving to divisional group positions in a wildland scenario to an MCI, or mass casualty incident, where we have MedCom using them to track resources and ambulances on and off scene. It's paramount for us to maintain our situational awareness and be able to account for everything that's happening. When we have 25 or 30 patients on scene, that's not the time for us to not have our stuff together. And it's imperative that we respond to the incident in a standardized way. We have to have a system in place that can overcome the challenges of the environment. And, and that's what the battle boards do for us. The battle board is a great tool for the incident command system because it's in a very compact, user-friendly form that allows us to adapt to all the different kinds of incidents we respond to. The scout really works for me in the wildland atmosphere the most when I'm away from my full-size battle board and I need to track incidents and personnel that are assigned to my division and other critical incident data. When things are predictable, they're preventable. The battle board enhances our communication to the point where it completely elevates our level of safety on the incident, which for incident commanders is our number one priority to make sure that our guys go home the next day.